As you can see, we take the vow of poverty very seriously here at St. Margaret's. What's upstairs? You won't find anything good up there. This is your room, Reverend... Nishant. It's very quaint, Mrs. Jakes. What vow did you break to get stuck with this dying parish? If not poverty, obedience, chastity? How long have you been in the service to the church, Mrs. Jakes? Long enough to see the evil spawned by greed, pride, and lust. Would you care for some tea? Your predecessor had peculiar tastes. It's very unusual. What is it? Tennis root from the garden. So, what happened to my predecessor? Reverend Paulson, is it? Just disappeared one day. And the police were no help. Did the police know about these? I think the church has enough trouble. Don't you agree? Good night, Mrs. Jakes. Her name is Anna, another thing Reverend Paulson left behind. Do the police know? I didn't want to get her involved. She's unstable and getting worse all the time, I'm afraid. Damaged. I'm not. Anna? I'm not damaged. Anna, go back to your room. It's trying to control me. I'm fighting it. She's one of them. Reverend, help me. She's suicidal. Anna. Anna, no one will hurt you, Anna. No one will hurt you. I'm Reverend Nishant. You are safe here. Anna, you're safe. You are good. I can taste it. What happened to you and... Reverend Paulson? It's a secret. Did he touch you? He made me take his blood. He said his blood was holy, but he lied. He was bad. It's not your fault, Anna. It's inside me, all the time, moving inside me, like a snake, like fire. It's twisting, burning. Anna, listen to me. I absolve you from all your sins. In the name of God, the Father of all mercies. You didn't give me my penance. You've already been through enough. You have to give me my penance. Do you know where Reverend Paulson is? Yes. Sorry, you have to be the one who found him. I was out. 
meditating. At Paulson's last parish, there were rumors of him being involved with young women. I never met him. Still, you priest as a small club. If there was any evidence, the church would have acted. Is there anything else? I have a few more questions for Mrs. Jakes. Then good night, Detective Alvarez. The thing that lives inside of Anna, it's killing her. She was pure enough to contain it until Paulson corrupted her. You know what will happen if it gets loose. Pestilence, war, famine. The world's on the brink. But I don't think Nishan is that pure. He still has her drawings. One more test. If he passes, then the ceremony will transfer a thing to him. And for his sake, I hope he's pure enough. I'll get the tea. Thank you for not mentioning Anna. She's had enough trauma. Does she have any relatives? Not that I know of. You are good, Reverend Nishant. St. Margaret is fortunate to have you. Oh. Mm -hmm.